Hey guys, my name is Sven, I'm from Geeks Life Luxembourg and I'm here today on Saturday on the Games Land event sponsored by, v by Fogialu and VLG. On the side of me is uh, Raphael, who is in charge and president of Fogialu and he's going to tell us a bit more about the event we are here today. Yeah. So Gameland is a collaborative event from both uh, the associations uh, We Live Games and VideoGames.lu. Uh, and uh, since we're both uh, gaming-oriented communities, uh, we thought we'd gather all our resources to put into a single event uh, and make something bigger than uh, any single one of our sessions could put on there. It's, it's, a, it's a big event because it's uh, 48 hours straight, no, no uh, sleeping pause, just straight gaming, non-stop. Sounds interesting, but if you have an event that has a duration of 48 hours non-stop, you, you must have a lot of uh, entertainment planned for the people coming here. Can, us, can you tell us more about it? Exactly. So, since we're also on a competitive side, uh, the main events are uh, competitive fighting games. Um, the first one on Friday was uh, Super Smash Bros. Melee. Then uh, on today, on Saturday, we had the Smash 4 tournament and later on in the evening we're going to have the Street Fighter 5 and King of Fighters uh, journeys. Then we're going to finish with uh, Tech and Tech 2 on Sunday and that's going to be the closing ceremony. Okay, so uh, what I've also seen is that, uh, for example, on the main stage there's a huge screen installed and uh, there was, uh, I was told that you're streaming. Can I, what is uh, all about it? Yeah. So the plan was to stream on Twitch for the whole duration of the event, but that kind of um, dropped because uh, it, it just didn't work with the network. So instead we are streaming on Facebook. Doesn't quite work as well as planned because they, uh, they drop us because of copyright issues, <laughs> because of music. Um, but yeah, it's, 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 it's fine otherwise. Um, and the stream, it's not only online, it's also streamed on the projected on the, on the, on the, on the screen. The, on the screen. Yeah. But I've also seen there's not only gaming events participating in the event, so uh, I, I've seen a workshop uh, just behind you, they're working on something. Can you, what is it? Yeah, so we planned on having a little bit more diversity um, to attract more people to get newcomers into gaming, and we thought workshops would be a great idea to do that. So right now uh, it's Nini Michiko, a cosplayer, who is showing the, the people around how to uh, create their own star from weapons or um, accessories. Uh, and later on we're going to have Dezo, who is going to show us how to um, form and paint their own squishy toys. Okay, sounds interesting. So what, uh, what are your thoughts about the events on the, until the moment now? Well, I was a little bit worried uh, about the non-stop gaming thing because you never know, will there be issues you know, with, the, with the locals, uh, are we too loud maybe, um, what about, what about you know, are, are people going to treat each other fairly, um, that's always going to be an issue. Uh, but I was really surprised because there was no issues, everything ran flawlessly, and I'm amazed, I'm really amazed. But when you have an event like this, which is uh, during 48 hours, you have some uh, possibilities for the people who want to stay here. We do have some um, places where people can rest. I mean, it's, it's not perfect for, for an entire night's sleep. Uh, but mo most gamers are fine with uh, one or two hours of rest. I mean, so are we, right? We have to. We have to. Okay, so that's uh, all for me from my side. So I am uh, thanking you for the interview, Raf, and Thank you. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the rest of the game.